Governor Gretchen Whitmer today giving state lawmakers her outline for new state budgets with very specific priorities. The more than $60 billion budget proposes a 45 cent per gallon increase in the state gasoline tax to pay for those road repairs. That tax would be imposed in three installments six months apart. Whitmer also wants a $500 million increase in education spending as well. The governor also calling for repealing the state pension tax. She says she's not the only governor calling for higher tax to fix the roads. Governor DeWine in Ohio has proposed 18 cent gas tax increase to fix Ohio's roads and bridges. And Ohio's roads are a heck of a lot better than ours are. All right. Now coming up tonight at five, we're going to dig into the reaction to the gas tax. Does the 45 cent increase really stand a chance in the Republican legislature? Rod Maloney is live in Lansing. We'll talk to him coming up at five o'clock. We're also following a developing story overseas after bombs are found around London. Police say they do believe there is, in fact, a connection between the three small explosive devices. They were found at two airports and a train station as well. The devices in mailing bags were found near Heathrow, London City Airport, and then also inside the Waterloo train station. When one package was opened, it started a small fire. Nobody was hurt, and so far, though, we should point out no one has claimed any responsibility. It was an emotional day in court for the family of Wayne County Sheriff Sergeant Lee Smith. Today, his loved ones found out how long the man responsible for Smith's death will be behind bars. Des Desmond Robinson will spend the next four to uh, a half and a f 15 years in prison, four and a half to 15 years in prison. Last summer, Sergeant Smith was off duty. He was jogging in Westland when he was hit and killed. Originally, though, Robinson pled not guilty in the case, but then later changed his plea.